Hi, this is Don McAllister and welcome to another edition of Screencasts Online. This is the second of a two-part look at the extremely popular AI service, ChatGPT. In this episode, we'll delve into third-party applications, as well as integrations available for both Mac and iOS. Now, if you haven't done already, I'd recommend that you check out episode 1249, where we looked at the basic features of ChatGPT, including setting up an account and starting to use prompts. To recap, ChatGPT is an AI, or artificial intelligence, that uses natural language processing, or NLP, that can simulate human conversation to understand and respond to user queries. Now, it's designed to be user-friendly and responsive, providing quick and accurate answers on a wide range of topics. ChatGPT bases its responses on the structure of language, on grammar, facts about the world, and even some reasoning abilities by analyzing the patterns and relationships within the text data that you input. It's important to note that ChatGPT's knowledge is limited to information available up to its training cutoff date in 2021, and it doesn't have real-time or updated information on recent events or developments. It should also be noted that responses produced by ChatGTP are not guaranteed to be complete, or even completely accurate, and you should never take what it says as verbatim or without fact-checking. So let's take a look at how some services have been built on top of ChatGTP. In the first episode, we looked at interacting with ChatGPT in real time, using the web interface to create prompts and review responses. However, in addition to this, it also has an application programming interface or API that allows developers to integrate ChatGPT into their own applications, products, or services. Now, there are two different integration approaches being taken by developers. The first are apps and services that provide customized access based on the type of work that you want to do with ChatGPT. And secondly, apps that give you a wrapper around the core functionality of the service. But let's start with the first one and give you some examples. Now, there are many different types of services that leverage ChatGPT technology, such as writing and content generation apps, programming and code generation apps, as well as language learning apps. They're usually priced using either a subscription model or possibly based on usage, or even sometimes both. And these sorts of applications are great if you don't want to learn too much about creating prompts because you allow the application to do the heavy lifting. I've selected five of the more popular services and they all very much help you with your writing, but each one is focused in a slightly different area. So this is Shortly over at shortlyai.com. And as you can see, this is intended to make writer's block a thing of the past. I should point out as well that all these services do have a free trial. Uh, I haven't tried each and every one, but if you want to go ahead and sign up for a free trial, you can do. But as you can see here, this is intended to uh, be your writing partner. And you have this one here, which is copy.ai. And this is more geared up to creating copy. So if you're in advertising or marketing, you want to go in and create a copy, you can use copy AI. The other one here is pseudo write. Again, this is another writing partner type application, which uh, is supposed to enable you to get off the bank page. So it gives you ideas in the first draft, etc. Uh, the next one is phrase. So this is intended to help you research, write and optimize high quality SEO content in minutes instead of hours. So if you have a website or a blog post or you're on social media and you want to craft your content to have optimum SEO, for web searches, etc., you can use this particular application. And then the final one here is one called Jasper over at jasper.ai. And again, this is, uh, this is more of a generalized one. It does include copy. It started to include graphics as well now and uh, images. We'll look at image generation in a separate show in the future because there are lots of different AI services that provide you with image creation. That's just a quick preview of one of this week's Apple-related tutorials from Screencasts Online. Screencasts Online is your premium source of Apple-related video tutorials. All of our members get access to brand new, up-to-date tutorials each week, as well as unlimited access to our entire video archive full of Mac and iOS-related tutorials. You can stream and download all of our videos on your Mac, iPad and iPhone and even your Apple TV using the members-only Screencasts Online Apple TV app. Membership also includes a complimentary subscription 
to the Digital Screencast Online monthly magazine, published each month and packed with videos, articles, reviews, as well as hints and tips covering all aspects of the Mac, iPad, iPhone, and all of the other fantastic Apple products. So, if you're ready to start getting the most out of your Apple devices, visit ScreencastsOnline.com today and become a ScreencastsOnline member.